hello everyone welcome to my mathematics class standard 6 chapter fraction chapter 4 fraction today we will discuss about multiplication of fractions product of fractions is equal to product of their numerators by product of their denominator for example let a by b and c by d are two fractions then a by b into c by d is equal to a into c by b into d take the product of their numerator by product of their denominator products numerator are a and c their product a into c by product of the denominator b and d are denominator so their product b into d so a by b into c by d is equal to a by c into b by d for example example 1 find the product 8 by 15 into 10 8 by 15 into 10 10 10 means 10 by 1 so 8 by 15 into 10 by 1 product of numerators 8 and 10 are numerators or 8 into 10 by product of denominator denominator are 15 and 1 15 into 1 now we divide 15 by 5 we get 3 on dividing 10 by 5 we get 2 cancelling out the common factors so 8 now remaining after that we have 8 into 2 16 in the numerator and 3 into 1 3 in the denominator now convert 16 by 3 into mixed fraction and it becomes 5 whole 1 by 3 9 by 16 into 4 by 27 first multiply the numerators 9 into 4 by the product of the denominator product uh, 16 into 7 we divide 9 by 9 and we get 1 and divide by dividing 27 by 9 we get 3 dividing 4 by 4 we get 1 dividing 4 by dividing 16 by 4 we get 4 so after that we have 1 in the numerator part 1 into 1 1 in the denominator part 4 into 3 12 now reciprocal of multiplicative inverse of a fraction if the product of two fraction is 1 then each is called the reciprocal of other for example let a by b is a fraction if we multiply b by a with a by b then we get 1 so the reciprocal of a by b is b by a and reciprocal of b by a is a by b it means that a by b is the reciprocal of b by a and b by a is the reciprocal of a by b in other words we can say a by b and b by a are multiplicative inverse of each other reciprocal of 5 by 8 is 8 by 5 reciprocal of 1 by 6 is 6 by 1 that is 6 reciprocal of 4 4 means 4 by 1 so its reciprocal is 1 by 4 division of fractions let a by b and c by b any two fractions then we define a by b divided by c by d which is equal to a by b into reciprocal of c by d that is d by c a by b into reciprocal of c by d the reciprocal of d c by d is d by c now perform multiplication simplify 15 by 4 5 by 14 divided by 2 by 7 we have 5 by 14 divided by 2 by 7 that's we gi that gives 5 by 14 into the division sign changes to into sign into multiplication sign and the and, and we take the reciprocal of the second fraction that is reciprocal of 2 by 7 is 7 by 2 now cancel out the common factor 7 1 the 7 7 to the 14 in the numerator part 5 into 1 5 by in the denominator part 2 into 2 4 and it is 4 whole 1 by 4 if it is converted to mixed fraction 5 by 6 divided by 10 5 by 6 divided by 10 10 means 10 by 1 so 5 by 6 into reciprocal of 10 by 1 1 by 10 cancelling out the common factors 5 1 the 5 5 to the 10 in the numerator part 1 into 1 1 in the denominator part 2 into 6 into 2 12 how many pieces of length one whole three by four meter each can be cut from a cloth 84 meter long total length of the cloth is 84 meter 
length of each piece is one whole three by four meter that is seven by four meter the number of pieces formed we get it by dividing the total length of the cloth by the length of each piece of cloth so total length of cloth is 84 divided by length of each piece of cloth is 7 by 4 so 84 the division becomes into in and we take the reciprocal of 7 by 4 that is 4 by 7 so 8 into 4 by 7 on dividing cancelling uh, dividing 84 by 7 we get 12 so 12 into 4 48 hence the required number of pieces is 18 now simplification of off an operation of off stands for multiplication of means into 1 by 2 of 32 which is equal to 32 into 1 by 2 off means into multiplication so 32 into 1 by 2 that is 16 numerical expression a combination of numbers connected by one or more of the symbols plus minus into division and off etc is called numerical expression simplification of an expression on performing various operation in a given expression and getting its value is called the simplification of the given expression for simplification of expressions we must perform this operation strictly in the following order we strictly follow the Bodmas rule where B stands for bracket, O stands for off, D stands for division, M stands for multiplication, A stands for addition, and S stands for subtraction. As mentioned earlier, the order of simplifying bracket is first we remove the bar bracket, then parenthesis, braces, and square bracket. This bracket is paren this is parenthesis, this bracket is parenthesis. This is process and this bracket is square bracket. These are the order of removing brackets and order of performing operations are first bracket of division, multiplication, addition and subtraction. Let us see some examples how to solve it, how to simplify. Find 5 by 7 of 63 that is 5 by 7 of 63 which is equal to 63 into 5 by 7 or 5 by 7 into 63 7 on the 7 7 9 the 63 9 into 5 45 now example 3 simplify 2 whole 1 by 3 minus 1 whole 1 by 2 of 4 by 5 plus 2 whole 2 by 5 divided by 3 whole 1 by 2 now uh, convert all the mixed fraction into improper fraction 2 whole 1 by 3 becomes 7 by 3 minus 1 whole 1 by 2 becomes 3 by 2 of 4 by 5 plus 2 whole 2 by 5 becomes 12 by 5 divided by 16 by 5 first remove the bracket remove the parenthesis now you have to perform um, subtraction lcm of 3 and 2 is 6 now 7 into 2 14 minus 3 into 3 9 of 4 by 5 plus 12 by 5 divided by 4 16 by 5 now 14 minus 9 5 by 6 of 4 by 5 plus 12 by 5 divided by 16 by 5 now removing of 5 by 6 in of 4 by 5 that is 5 by 6 into 4 by 5 5 5 cancelled 4 1 the 4 4 2 uh, 2 2 the 4 2 3 the 6 so that is 2 by 3 5 by 6 of 4 by 5 equals to 2 by 3 plus 12 by 15 divided by 16 by 5 now which is equal to 2 by 3 plus 12 by 5 the division becomes multiplication and we take the reciprocal of 16 by 5 that is 5 by 6 and 2 by 3 plus 5 5 cancelled dividing 12 by 4 we get 3 and 16 by 4 we get 4 so that is 2 by 3 plus 3 by 4 now LCM of 3 by 4 3 and 4 is 12 we multiply 2 into 4 8 and multiplying 3 into 3 we get 9 8 plus 9 by 12 which is equal to 17 by 12 which is equal to 1 whole 5 by 12 we remove bracket of division multiplication and plus this is all about simplification word problems
Amon earns rupees twenty three thousand two hundred per month and saves three by eight of his income. Find his monthly saving, monthly expenditure, his monthly saving. First, to find monthly saving three by eight of his monthly income. His monthly income is twenty three thousand two hundred. So twenty three thousand two hundred into three by eight, and that gives eight thousand seven hundred. His monthly expenditure, expenditure earning minus saving. Earning twenty three thousand two hundred minus seven eight 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 thousand seven hundred, which is rupees fourteen thousand five hundred. His monthly expenditure. In a school, five by eight of the students are boys, and the number of girls is five hundred forty. Find the total strength of the school. The total number of boys in the school. First, you see parts of boys in the school five by eight. Part of a girl, one minus five by eight, eight is the LCM. So eight into one, eight minus five, that is three by eight. So number of girls is four hundred, five hundred forty. We have three by eight of total strength is five hundred forty. So total strength is equal to five hundred forty into eight by three, that gives fourteen hundred forty. So number of boys in the school, total strength minus number of girls. Fourteen hundred forty minus five hundred forty. That is nine hundred. Representation of fractions on a number line. To do so, represent three by five on a number line. First, we draw a number line and take a point O in the middle. From O, set equal distances on the right side and left side. These equal distances are one, two, three. These are the right hand side of Right hand side to O, and to the left hand side of O are minus one, minus two, and etc. Now, between O and one, this length, the length of O and one, the distance of O, divide the distance of O into five equal parts. One, two, three, four, five, and take three equal parts out of five parts. One, two, three. This arrow mark represents the three. Equal parts out of five equal parts represented by P, that is three by five. Find one by five plus two by five using number line. First, take a number line, take a point over the middle, and now take equal distances. To the right of O, and name this as one by five, two by, and the uh, from O to A is the one unit. The the distance from O to A is one unit. Now divide the one unit distance into four equal five equal parts. Now you have to add one by two plus two by five. One by five. This this is one by five, two by five, three by five, four by five. So from zero to one by five. Again two by five means move. Two steps towards right, one, two, and we reached at three by five. So sum of one by five and two by five is three by five. Subtraction. Divide the unit seven by nine minus five by nine in the same manner. Take a number line, set a point O, and the distance from O to A. Is one unit. Now divide the one unit distance into nine equal parts, and each part represents one by nine. So seven by nine from O move to seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven step towards right, and we reached at seven by nine. Minus five by nine from seven by nine. Move back. Move back. Five step one two three four five and we reached at two by nine. So seven by nine minus five by nine is equal to two by nine. Nine is equal to two by nine. This is all about chapter four, which is about fraction. We discussed all the things related with fraction in this chapter. Uh, addition subtraction multiplication division and simplification of related to fractions and the word problems related to fractions i will send the answer of each chapter 
but you have to do some homework thank you